Now, building a godly family in this day and age is not an easy thing. And after all, would kids these days really go for that stuff anyway? Hi, I'm Bernie Diamond, and welcome to today's episode of Fresh. Over the last little while, I've been sharing some tips on building a godly family from good friends of mine, Mark and his wife, Precious, who've brought up nine children in the most amazingly godly way. We've been talking about challenging children with God's word in different situations, relying on Jesus in parenting, living a godly life for our children to learn from, and relying on God's grace. And maybe you've thought to yourself, nah, the kids would never go for this stuff. So I decided to ask the children what they thought about being part of a godly family. Here are some of the things that they said. Firstly, they all loved being part of a large family. The youngest had enjoyed their morning Bible readings together. One of the older ones going to church together. They'd enjoyed having to learn to forgive one another and their family prayer times together. In fact, honestly, I was taken aback by the enthusiasm with which they spoke about their godly upbringing. You see, it's easy to imagine that kids would never go for this stuff, that they'd never want to spend time with their parents growing in their relationship with Jesus. Hmm. Maybe we should think again. Deuteronomy chapter 6, verses 5 to 7. You must love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your strength. Always remember these commands that I've given you today and be sure to teach them to your children. Talk about these commands when you sit down in your house and when you walk on the road. Talk about them when you lie down and when you get up. That's God's word, fresh for you today. It's amazing how contrary God's wisdom is to the so-called wisdom of this world. That's why it's so important to hear God speak his wisdom into our lives every day. You can receive this devotional in your inbox each day. Just stop by at ChristianityWorks.com and you'll see the fresh sign up right there at the top of the homepage. And when you do subscribe, you'll immediately receive a copy of my ebook, How Can I Hear God Speak to Me? That web address again is ChristianityWorks.com.